Hey guys, so welcome back to my channel. It is your girl. Mm. <laughs> hey guys, welcome back to Life of V. I'm your girl V, and this is my life. Today, we are doing a quick tutorial on how I get my my little twisties. Um, you've probably seen it on the gram. I got a few messages asking how I accomplished the look. Um, as you guys can see, my hair is slowly growing back. Um, and yeah, it's that awkward phase right now where the top is really long and the sides are short it's like in a really weird phase um if you guys don't know if you're new to my channel i did do a big chop so head over you know to my main screen and uh go check out that video but um since i did the big chop i cut my hair three times um since then and it's been almost a year like in a couple of days it will be a year since i did my big chop so um yeah but yeah it's taking us time growing back and um, I've been trying to figure out little styles um, to do while it's in the growing phase. <laughs> so I start off with their Hydrate and Repair Shampoo. Can you guys see that? Um, before I was using the um, black soap one um, and I love that one but I just wanted to like switch it up and see you know, you know just try a new product and see what works best for my hair. Um, so yeah, I'm trying out this one. Um, it's the Manuku Honey, I think that's how you say it. And uh, yogurt, <clears throat> and it's to hydrate and repair. So I got this one because my hair, um, I've dyed it um, a couple of times. Um, you can see, sorry, my hair's a little dirty, I have gel and stuff in it. But yeah, I have dyed my hair a few times and the ends are pretty damaged. My hair is just, super dry so yeah I wanted to try this out um, and see if it helps um, along with this I got the hydrate and repair um, protein power treatment you guys see that there we go so I got that um, so what I do is I wash my hair um, two times and then um, I put this along with another mixture that you guys will see me um, put together in a little minute um, and I put that in I put a plastic bag over my head and let it soak for a little moment probably about like 20 minutes 20 to 30 minutes um, and then I rinse it out and um, then I go in with this uh, it is the um, it says multi-activation leave in so it's just the leave-in conditioner and it's like a spray bottle. Go wash my hair and uh, we'll get into it. As you just see, my hair is washed. Um, 
Uh, I don't really dry my hair with a towel. They say it's not good to dry your hair with a towel because it's kind of coarse, I guess. Um, so I just got a wife beater, or old wife beater, and I uh, dried my hair. And this is what it looks like. What? Yeah, you see the curls coming true. There's, is, there's no product or anything in it. This is what it looks like. The back, can you guys see? Am I in frame? I don't even know if I'm in frame. So that's what the back looks like. Um, so now I'm going to, now I'm going to uh, deep condition my hair. So I'll show you guys what products I use to do that. So let's get into it. Alrighty, so um, I already cracked the egg. Uh, we just need the yolk of the egg. Um, and then I'm going to use some of the hydrate and repair uh, protein power treatment. Uh, I'm gonna put a little bit of that in there. I say a little bit, I really mean a lot. And then I am just going to um, put some of this uh, coconut oil and open it up so you guys can see it's, it's like pure coconut oil. So I'm just going to put a little bit of that in there. And then I'm going to mix it all together. Um, Normally, I would use maybe like avocado or banana, but I don't have either one of those right now, so this is just gonna have to do for now. Okay. And then, there we go. You can see all, everything in there. I'm just gonna mix that. I don't use the egg whites because it leaves like pieces of crap in my hair. And I've learned my lesson, so sometimes it still happens, but like not as much as it, it used to. So I'm just gonna mix this up with good. Sure, you know everything is blended things nice and blended into my hair. I'm just gonna, you know, just take it into my hand and just throw it on. Just massage it in. are some like clumps for to focus and you just kind of just gotta massage it through and the clumps will come out and it's just from the um the coconut oil so yeah you just massage it all the way through your hair yeah I'll make sure every strand gets a little loving
ready. So everything is all in. Um, everything, I use all of it. Um, so now I'm just going to set my timer. I'm gonna set my timer for 30 minutes. Actually, I'm gonna do I'm gonna do 40. I'm gonna watch a episode of Grey's. <laughs> so I'm gonna set it to 40 minutes. Y'all see that? 40 minutes. I'm gonna put my um, plastic bag over my head so that it can you know steam nicely, and then we will be. A few inches later. <laughs> I look super crazy right now. <laughs> so, um, it's been about 45 minutes. I've let it go a little bit over, just five minutes over. Um, and I'm going to take this off. It's so hot under here. Like, oh my God, it is so hot. Okay. This works, guys. You guys don't need to buy no steaming cap and all that extra, extra stuff. Just get a plastic bag, rip it a little at the, the little handles, rip it a little, and then you tie it at the back. So I'm about to go wash this out. Can you guys see this? Like, bruh. It's hot. Yeah, so I'm gonna go wash this out. Um, I'm not gonna take you guys there with me. I'm just gonna do a little quick rinse. I'm not gonna shampoo or anything. Just on some lukewarm water, rinse it out, and then I'll be right back, okay? See you in a minute. All right, guys, so I'm back. I just rinsed out my hair. You might see like a couple little um, pieces of uh, the coconut oil, but um, it feels really good. It feels really good. Um, sorry, I'm on my bed and it's a little squeaky, so <laughs> don't judge me in my squeaky bed. Um, so when I rinsed it out, um, I didn't really like scrub and like go ham. I just kind of did like a light rinse because I still want some of the product to kind of be in my hair, if that makes sense. Um, but right now my hair feels really nice. It's nice and soft. It feels really good. Close, look at my hair. As I said, there's some pieces of the coconut oil still left in my hair. And I know it's the coconut oil because I just took it out and when you rub it together, it just becomes oil. So I just know it's the coconut oil. Um, but yeah, so now I am gonna go in with the leave-in conditioner, the Hydrate Repair uh, Multi-Action Leave-In Conditioner by Shea Moisture. Um, and I'm just gonna spray this all throughout my hair. And honestly guys, there's like no technique to this. Um, everybody has their own way of doing their hair. Um, but this is just like the way that I found to like work on my hair. Um, I, I, I also don't comb my hair. I don't put a comb in my hair. Like, I can't remember the last time like I actually combed my hair. Like the only time is if like I'm parting it. If I'm parting it, like I, I rocked four braids the other day for the first time um, since I cut my hair. So I had two and two. And um, yeah, I parted my hair. And that was like, that's as far as I go when it comes to a comb. Um, but anyway, so I'm just gonna saturate my hair, rub that bad boy in, and I don't really dry my hair off either. I kind of just um, let it be wet 
<laughs> and then I just grab a piece of hair. As I said, I don't, um, I don't use a comb, so I just grab a section of hair. And let me get a little closer, and I just twist. And I literally do this to my entire head. Um, before I couldn't do with my sides, so I was using um, Kinky Curly's um, Curl Custard. Um, and I would just rub that in on the top and it would get really curly and then I would just slick down my sides because I couldn't twist it. Um, and it didn't, it just didn't look good. Um, but now that my sides have been growing, I can twist them. See, I can do these little twisties. And um, yeah, and they curl, they stay curly. So as I said, I just, there's no real method. Um, I just grab a piece and I twist. And as I said, I do this to my entire head. Why I don't um, part or comb through my hair is because I don't want it to look perfect. You know what I mean? I'm just going for this natural, you know, kind of look and I just don't want it to look perfect. I just want it to look rough and yeah. And if I part it, it's gonna have like perfect parts and whatnot, so I just don't want that. Alrighty, oh. Alrighty, so um, I'm all done with my little twisties. Um, yeah, so um, this is how it looks. And sometimes I just go over them, just like how you see me doing right now. Um, just to make sure they're nice and tight. The back ones probably look like really gross because it's kind of hard to reach the back when my hair is so short, but um, I try. And they don't always turn out the best, but. So yes, this is what it looks like. Um, so yeah, I will see you guys in the morning. It is 12.18 right now. And um, yeah, I'm gonna go to bed and um, we'll see how everything looks in the morning. Yeah, I know what it is, man. <laughs> it's your boy CJ in this. We just sat here, you know, chilling, we're waiting for the Raptors game. I know it's nine o'clock, but I'm. Woo! 421. We still got about like four and a half hours. <laughs> we in the six. We in the six. But continue your video. Thanks. That was my brother, guys. Go spam his page, tell him that we want to do our uh, sibling right. tag. Let's do our sibling tag. Go follow him at, what is your thing? See Lay. See Lay. Yeah, I know what it is, man. Oh my God, it's I didn't boy, say that. <laughs> <laughs> it's C-Lay 22, 22. My birthday, 22. Let's get it, two is my number. C C E E. L A Y 22. <laughs> Those are not the letters. Those are not the letters? No, it's not. Oh. <laughs> okay, anyway, back to my video. So I'm just gonna untwist my twisties. There's... Alrighty, so normally I put some um, olive oil, this olive oil in it. Can you guys see that? <clears throat> I throw some of that in my hair, um, but it's done. <laughs> see if there's anything yeah there it's done so but yeah normally I just put that in and I unravel them um, yeah. and that's how they turn out so just 
unravel my whole head and then I'll run through it with um, some more coconut oil just to give it a little bit more moisture and I know I have my uh, nose strip on because I am doing a face wash um, you, you know one by one and then there's no technique to this I know like a lot of youtubers like try and make it look like you gotta unravel it from here and nah just pull them out homie just pull them out I don't know if that's the correct way, but this is how I do it. <laughs> you know what I mean? Just pull them out. But I would recommend like having some product, some oil on your hand as you unpull them. Just so that it can bring some moisture back into the hair. So I just go and I just... Pull. And I guess it's different because my hair isn't long. So maybe that's why it's very easy for me to just them apart ready so most of them are out so I just kind of go through with my hands because I told you that before I don't really use a comb and I kind of just you know fluff it up see if I feel any more but yeah I just kind of kind of fluff it up but I mainly do the middle because I like the middle to look more voluminous if that makes sense um and yes that is how I achieve my twisties my little twist out look if some of them are not curly I kind of just go through and just do a little coil up coil up um because I'm not going like out out, I'm not gonna like throw on a beat face. I'm not gonna do all of that and like, you know, beautify myself. <laughs> um, because I literally have to go, I'm really rushing right now, but I just really wanted you to see like the takedown aspect. So I am gonna insert um, some photos of what it looks like, you know, when everything's finished, the whole face is beat. And the edges are laid for the gods. <laughs> um, yeah, so you guys will see a photo of that. Um, don't forget, guys, to like, share, and subscribe. Don't forget to leave a comment up in the comment section below um, to tell me, give me suggestions about hair colors and hair styles that I should try. Um, thank you guys so much for coming along with me on this journey. Like the video, I hope you guys are liking the new videos I've been uploading. Um, and yeah, if you haven't checked out those videos, I posted my update video where you can see everything that I've been up to 2019. And also, um, my Jamaica vlog also went live. So check those two videos out. And um, thanks again for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.